everybody, it's Rob Holman with Northwest Fishing Reports. It's Bass Week here in Washington State, and we're fishing the Potholes Reservoir with Ross Outdoor Adventures and Levi Rodello and warm water fish biologist Danny Garrett. Levi, can you tell us a little bit about how to find fish in the heat of the summer? So, I try for the best success, I try to get out as early as possible. You know, the top water bite is always best first thing in the morning. Um, some days it, it does go all day long. When it gets really hot, these fish tend to move into some of these mats. Um, you know, these, this bull rush we have up here, it looks like it's really thick, but that mat on top of it creates a canopy. And so if we go around this point here and we catch two or three fish, it'd be a good idea to slow down and throw some plastic and see if we can pick off a few more. Uh, now, if you're going along and your topwater bite is just incredible, there's no reason to slow down. Just keep fishing that topwater all the way through all that stuff. One of the things about topwater too, especially on potholes, everyone thinks it's just a morning thing. I've had tournaments and fun fishing days where you can throw topwater all day long. And they just, they don't stop biting it some days. It's so weird. And it's not just frogs, you know, there's walking baits, there's poppers. When you're in the weeds, obviously you want something that's weedless, but you know, if you're fishing along the face of the dam with all those rocks, uh, a walking bait or a hula popper is a really good option. And pick off as many fish as you can. 